Well, I wake up around I don't know, like 7.45 or something like that. And grab Andy, usually take him to daycare. And then I head off to school and do all my classes. And I come home, try and get some schoolwork done or some cleaning done. And then I go and pick him up and hang out with him. And, you know, play games and keep him busy, stuff like that. Hey, give him a bath, put him to bed, and then like the days I don't have class, I just hang out with Andy all day, and which is usually pretty cool as long as he's, you know, happy. But you know, a lot of times he just gets into these moods where he just like, cries all day, just got the same noise, grating and grating and grating. <laughs> you just like put your head through a wall after a while, but I mean. He's a good kid, but he d he definitely makes life a lot a lot more difficult, especially when you don't have a job and you're in school to get a job. It just it makes it a lot harder to get that like what would be easy done. Uh, get up six, seven, eight in the morning. Go to work. <coughs> You think you get up at six yeah, in the morning? You I get try up at like to, try to get one up. in the afternoon. Whatever, bullshit. I don't remember the last time I've gotten up past nine to go to work. Uh, okay, well, to go know, to work. I know last weekend you definitely. Woke oh, up on the weekends morning. I sleep in like two. I don't care. It's the weekend. Anyways, so all I gotta do is get drunk and play football, or watch football. Sorry, I interrupted. Go. <laughs> yeah, so get up in the morning, go to work, then do physical labor for eight, nine, ten hours, and then come home if I'm lucky or go straight to school go to class to 10 come home after that and drink a beer and go to sleep and do it again it's very monotonous but the jobs are different so that's the only that's a good thing about everything's different that we're doing but it's just physical labor it sucks that's about it <laughs> and then jam too if we ever have time yeah it's like a once every couple weeks kind of thing yep I guess like what originally hit me was like, uh, my dad tried to get me to play guitar a long time ago and I wasn't really feeling it. And then, uh, well he taught me after I met Flea from the Chili Peppers. Like I was down in Costa Rica and uh, with my parents. And they said, that's Flea over at the bar. And I didn't know who the hell Flea was back then. I'm just like, okay. But eventually like I went and talked to him and he like, took me out and he taught me how to surf and uh, out on the water and then he uh, brought me back to like his little shack thing where we were staying and he like played me a song on the guitar and just talked to him for a while he was really cool and then uh, I don't know like I heard their music and stuff and like, ever since then I always really wanted to play bass so I finally got one when Andrew was born since I figured I was going to be in the house a lot uh, yeah that's, that's really why I do it what was the question again? why do you play music yeah oh because uh, it's fun and it's uh, pretty much all I've done my whole life so the only one thing I can do kind of right in my life so I try to stick to it it's so about it why did you start doing that why did I start doing it because uh, my dad was a drummer and his dad was a drummer so got into it that way that was pretty much it and uh, I did a talent show in seventh grade and I got really popular for it playing the drums in the talent show so I was getting a lot of chicks that was the other reason I did it girls girls for real it's not even a lie drummers do get some action now and again yeah <laughs> I did it for my girl 
I can't wait till the girlfriend hears that one. <laughs> Why, dude? <laughs> You're not playing drums anymore. You should anymore. say, yeah, but that's how I got you, baby. Yeah, right? It is kind of. Whatever. It's definitely not one of my downs. It's not like, oh, he's a drummer. <laughs> you know what I mean? <laughs> <laughs> she doesn't seem too She's like, I love you, honey, but the drums, <laughs> they gotta go. <laughs> it's me time. Well, I guess our time. Like, get away from school and shit. Yeah, I mean, like, I don't know. I feel like you and I had a, a stronger bond once we started playing together. Yeah. Like, I feel like we knew each other and we were roommates, but then it was like the first time that we played together. I was like, James is awesome. Like, I really like this guy. Yeah. Like, you know. Yeah, see, I told you, so, James just had that effect on people. 